Welcome to your healing session. I hope you're doing as well as possible. If you are new here, I'm honored that you've decided to stop by for this energetic session. Supportive healing session. My name is Anna. I'm a Reiki Master Practitioner. I love ASMR. I love meditation. I'm a passionate advocate for energetic healing and mindfulness. So welcome. It's such a joy to be able to connect with you. I put a little bit of lavender on my hand. I just want you to lie back and relax melt into this present moment, sink into the here and now, and just allow me to help you heal yourself. When we can start to practice calming down our minds and really breaking free of the mental vortex, incessant thought and really give over to relaxation that's when our bodies can start to heal I believe that's really when the healing begins so this session is for you just to help you support you so really take this time, be kind to yourself, show up here from a place of openness, peace. Slow your breathing. Maybe even deepen it if that feels nice. Um, for this session, what I'd like to do just leave it open for you. I'm so fortunate that I get messages from you sharing how you are, what you're doing. One of you shared that you're, you're battling stage four cancer and that really stayed with me and I've been sending you love. And I'm so honored that I get to connect with you. Thank you for sharing your story. So I wanted this session to be open to you, no matter what you're moving through. So this session here is for whatever it is that you need some help with. So I'm going to leave this intention very open. The focus here is just going to be on support and love. And if you're open to sharing what it is that you're moving through, feel free to do so. And then I know you all are so good at commenting on each other's comments. and sending love and support, so maybe we can use this as an opportunity to really connect with one another and send that beautiful positive energy to each other while we're moving through these things, okay? If you're open to it. So we'll light a little bit of this myrtle and fern candle. use this in 
incense to light it off of our candle. And then we'll light this candle and we'll blow this out. So this incense can kind of get started. crackly wood wick the candle. So on behalf of your highest, wisest, most empowered, most aligned self, in loving comfort and in perfect balance, I wish to conduct this Reiki session for supporting you wherever you are, for sending you love, and for helping you to arrive in a state of calm peace. I'm going to bring this closer just so that you can gaze into the flame and really be intentional about the focus of this practice. Feel free to connect with whatever it is that you're moving through. And what you'd need, you know, what you'd like some extra support with. We can use these elements, our earthly elements, fire, air, water, earth, to really help us to ignite this energy. Strengthen it. Wonderful. As always, feel free to pause if you need a little bit more time. I'm going to begin by just placing this rose quartz right on your heart space, okay? Whatever you're moving through, it could be different in five minutes from now, it could be different tomorrow, it could be different from yesterday. It's just important to be present with yourself and to accept yourself just as you are right here, right now. And ask for what you need right here, right now. I'm going to begin... Shaking up the energy so that we can really connect with this thick, full, really vibrant aura. I'm going to start at your feet.
I'm going to use a little bit of frankincense and sandalwood. This was charged during the Lionscape portal. So it's really, really powerful. Very healing. Maybe together we can, if you're open to it, start to rub our hands, palm to palm, rubbing them together, creating a little bit of reiki. vibrant and alive, and you might even start to sense into an invisible orb. What I'd like for you to do is place this on an area of tension or tightness in your body. Place that orb on your body. So let's say many of us get tension and tightness in our throat. So let's just imagine that that's the case and we would just place that in our throat. Like so. Allowing it to fill up the space of our neck. If it was our chest, it's the same. Take that full of energy and place it in our chest. Sometimes we hold tension in our stomach. Just inviting in a supportive, loving orb of light into an area of tension in your body. If your tension is mostly emotional or you feel it in your energetic body, do the same. You could just place it over your crown and let it swim and swirl and float all through your body. Try to locate these areas of tension so that you can start to heal them. Misty, it almost looks like a misty sunset over the ocean. Pink sky at night, sailor's delight. <sighs> Loving, gentle, healing stone. These two stones I love to use for physical healing. So if you're moving through anything physical, chronic illness, things like that. I like to use these two stones. Is this a turquoise or raw turquoise? Beautiful stone for healing any physical ailments. Isn't that a pretty one? <laughs> Actually, that's turquoise too. So we have two. And then this Chinese writing stone 
wonderful stone for connecting with our vital life force energy, which is what Reiki is all about, connecting us with that vital life force energy. to be soothed, activating what needs to be activated. If anyone is wondering what the music is underneath this session, for those of you who are new, this music was composed for me by my cousin. from that 
my little family owned company that I told you about. A recent video. This is called The Pure Incense Co. And I met the woman who makes these, hand makes them, and who. Her, and I met her family and everybody, and they were just so lovely. But again, um, some of the incense does contain ghee. So if you are vegan, just be mindful of that. She links the ones that do. So. Anyway, I love this. I think the scents are incredible, and I've been really enjoying using them. you see? Can you see it up close? Maybe I'll sit down. See how pretty it is? It's just really gorgeous. It's a beautiful, beautiful incense. you have rain from the properties of the incense itself. So water, air because of the smoke, fire because of the cherry igniting the tip, and earth because there's bamboo and a lot of these aspects that make up the stick. Here we go. Very balanced. Okay. I'm just going to draw the sacred symbols outside of your heart.
now do a little bit of clearing here. This one has a really fresh scent. It almost smells like fresh laundry.
needs tending to. That's where this energy is going. Your intention is so important here. Your intention to fill up the space, to send healing light, to invite my energy into your space. Setting that intention is so important so that as we deeply connect with what's going on for us, we want to start to have the confidence and strength and self-love to ask for what we need. really, really hard thing to do. We're taught not to do that. Mm. Mm, I think it takes a great deal of courage. A great deal of wisdom to know what it is that we need. A great deal of bravery to be able to ask for. to ask for it with love. Love and kindness. This is a beautiful thing. That's one thing I've realized is that most people do want help. Most people do want help. I'm going to place my hands over your eyes like that, very gently. I'm just kind of cupping them over your eyes, okay? Just breathe. Just breathe. A sense of release, a sense of calm. See if there's any tension around the eye that you can let go of. It's okay, you can let go. You can let go. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's Placing these stones just slightly to the side. I'm going to use this singing bowl. to heal you.
Okay, my love. I'm gonna lift your vibration one more time using this owl rattle. Such a friendly, cheerful little rattle. Love it. This time, starting at your crown and moving. beautiful lifted frequency. It's from this place that you can start to heal. You are divine. You are connected. You are expressive. You are loved. You are strong. You are creative. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you have the most beautiful day or night. Take good care of yourself. Take good care of each other. Thank you so much for being here. I'm so grateful to you. And until we meet again. So sending that love towards you and see if you can just maybe breathe it in. Fill yourself up with that gorgeous loving energy. Imagine the aroma just swirling in and flowing all through your body. and channeled with laser-like precision to help you accomplish tasks and achieve objectives. Cool. This is going to be a really powerful time for you. Two super empowering cards. You have this fiery energy and you have like the earth and the roots. The roots and the ancestors. It's like star and earth and fire. Find as comfortable a position as you can. Maybe close your eyes, you could lie down, whatever feels right for you. And let's begin today with gratitude. Whatever position you find yourself in, bring to heart one thing for which you are grateful. 